Hello there people of the internet, my name is Tom from the Down and Melon and welcome back to Minecraft Theories, uh, part 2 of the Herobrine Theory. Now the reason why I'm revisiting this is not only because my first one was a huge success and is, one, and is literally the most popular video on my channel, it's because I have some comments from you guys, I have over 21 comments on it, uh, well actually no I have 20, I have 20 comments from you guys saying that's um, saying quite a couple of uh, interesting things. So I picked out three of the comments today of which I'm going to be reading. Uh, first one is from a guy called Stevie Smiles and Ban Damages. It says, I'm definitely a believer of what you just said, although hallucin hallucinogens are what is created when the mind isn't stimulated. For example, if you were to stare at a blank TV screen for a whole week with no sleep, you'd hallucinate. Not because you haven't slept, it's because your brain is constantly trying to stay active. In other words, if you do not do nothing but sit there with no one around in your room, you'd hallucinate. Like I said, minus hallucinate for extreme, from extreme boarding. boredom. Dear God, I can't, I can't, I can't talk today. Creating Herobrine. But someone has to have programmed the illusion into the game, right? Not just the male career, right? Like he said, kids hide underneath their cupboards to protect from monsters, right? Well, the reason kids hide is so that they won't get hurt. They also fear death. Death is a product in the game. So basically, you are right. Thank you very much for your comment, dude. It means quite a lot to me that you had the fact you've actually taken an interest of what I've put down. Uh, I actually agree with you. I actually believe that if you do mine for quite a certain period amount of time without any rest, you do start seeing stuff. I've seen it before. I've seen other players see it before. They're like, oh my god, what's that? The turn over there, you know, they're turning all over the place. And they're like, oh my god, I can't see stuff. I can't see stuff. And I'm like, I'm sure I saw something. Uh, so yeah, I, I agree at the fact that, you know, like, somebody must have programmed it into the game. I agree that... I, I actually semi-agree with you on that one, because Minecraft itself, where I'm standing here, there's 30 million by 30 million other blocks. Anything could be in there. And this creepy-ass mother over here, with his bloody eyes. Right, yeah, yeah, I'm looking at you, sir. He, uh, he's, he, he seems to be quite threatening, but maybe, maybe the next comment might say a couple more things. This guy, uh, the next comment is from a guy called, uh, Lord Widge Crudop. Okay, sorry about that, my mic cut off there, but the, the next, uh, the next comment is from a guy called Lord Widge Crudop. And he says, let me finish your theory. Portal. I know what you're thinking. What does Portal have to do with Herobrine in Minecraft? The companion cube. You're playing Portal, you're all alone, and after some levels, you're getting so lonely, you will love everything you get. You get companion cube, and because you're so lonely, it becomes your best friend. There's another theory by the Game Theory, so I'll leave their channel link down in the description so below so you guys can actually check them out. Uh, which provides, uh, I'm sorry, which proves the Companion Cube is a human and they're letting you destroy it because of the easy trusting. This is kind of like Minecraft, you're all alone, there's no other people, so you start hallucinating that there's someone else. Herobrine. Now this guy seems to be, seems to know what's up. I, I have played Paul, I know what it's like to be in Paul. You are extremely, extremely lonely. I don't know why there's a village over here, goddammit. <laughs> you, you get extremely lonely in Paul. And people have theorised that the companion cube does actually have a person inside, but after a while you just incinerate it and you'll never really know. Um, so yeah, um... I do know what you're saying, I do know that, you know, you, you do start hallucinating, I mean, I've not actually, I think this is more or less for, like, younger players of the game, like, people that are seven, like, they're all alone in the game, you know, they're just like, oh, well, let's, let's, just, let's just imagine some friends. I don't know why, but I, uh, if they were going to imagine a friend, I would, uh, I would have, like, I would have imagined someone like me, or Notch, or Steve, wouldn't have imagined a guy with no eyes. That's a little bit creepy, but I do know what he's saying, like, your imagination does get a little bit of a hold of you when you play Minecraft. I mean, obviously, otherwise I wouldn't be able to, like, build and stuff like that, but maybe it gets a little bit too wild, I'm not really sure. So moving on to the next comment. Okay, so the next comment is by a guy called The Exploding Bacon, and he says, I just thought of this idea when you said about Notch's stepbrother. Perhaps Notch tried to create another Steve in your game to help you out, but he messed up the coding to be evil, not good. Also, he probably messed up the skin as well. So as I just said there, the skin on Herobrine is like only a block difference to Steve, really. Steve has two... Steve has two blue pe pe blue pupils. Herobrine has no pupils. But um, maybe he did try to create another type of NPC. Now, I don't know if you knew this, but in Minecraft Alpha and Beta, the original NPCs were going to look like this with all the weird noses. I know they've not got weird noses in this texture pack because I am using a different resource pack than the vanilla. But they were originally going to be like 
walking up pigmen. So technically like these guys, just let me grab one out. Ah, no, nope, not this one. Where is he? There we go. Ah. I do know what he's saying. Like, maybe he was trying to create a different type of NPC, but it turned out to be good, not evil. I'll never know, but maybe you guys will never know either. But, uh, yeah, if you want to continue feeling this and trying to figure out the Herobrine theory by itself, don't forget to leave a comment down in the comment section below of this video or any other of my Minecraft theory videos. So, and, yeah, if you if you've liked what you see and, you, and if you aren't, sorry, if you are new to the channel and you do like what you see, don't forget to hit that like and the subscribe button. And as always, people, stay fruity. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh,